Hello there, dear travelers. Welcome to the beautiful city of Islamabad, the capital of Pakistan. Today, I'll be your enthusiastic tourist guide, and we are about to embark on an exciting journey exploring some of the most splendid and historically significant places this city has to offer. Our adventure begins at Faisal Mosque, an architectural marvel and one of the largest mosques in the world. Built in the late 20th century, it showcases a perfect blend of contemporary and traditional Islamic design. As we stand in awe of its majestic beauty, here's a fun fact. Did you know that the mosque structure is inspired by a Bedouin tent? Now, let's move on to our next destination. Next up, we'll visit Lok Versa Museum, where you can immerse yourselves in Pakistan's diverse cultural heritage. The museum exhibits a vast collection of traditional art, crafts, and historical artifacts from different regions of the country. It's a fantastic opportunity to learn about Pakistan's rich cultural tapestry and appreciate its artistic legacy. Now, we'll take a short drive to Damanico Viewpoint, situated in the scenic Margala Hills National Park. The panoramic view of Islamabad from here is breathtaking, making it a popular spot for locals and tourists alike. Get your cameras ready, and don't forget to capture the awe-inspiring landscape. After enjoying the picturesque views, let's head to Pakistan Monument, an iconic symbol of the country's unity and pride. The architecture is a fusion of Islamic and modern designs, representing the four provinces and three territories of Pakistan. Here's a punnage joke for you. Why did the monument become an architect's favorite? Because it always had a point to make. Our next stop is Taxila Museum, located just outside Islamabad. It's a treasure trove of artifacts dating back to the Ganhara civilization, which flourished over two millennia ago. This ancient city was a significant center of art, culture, and learning in its time, attracting scholars from around the world. Remember, folks, the past is always priceless, and you'll find some real gems in this museum. Now, we'll travel to Ravel Lake, a serene man-made reservoir surrounded by lush greenery. It's a perfect place for a peaceful boat ride or a leisurely stroll along the lakeshore. And speaking of lakes, did you hear about the one that loved classical music? It was a real, concerted, effort to keep it clean. As the day nears its end, let's conclude our tour with a visit to Sadpur village. This charming little enclave exudes a rustic and traditional vibe. You'll find quaint streets, artsy cafes, and a chance to interact with the locals, who are known for their warmth and hospitality. Trust me, you'll leave with a smile on your face and a heart full of fond memories. I hope you had a fantastic time exploring Islamabad with me today. It's been an absolute pleasure being your guide. Remember, my fellow travelers, wherever you go, always keep your hearts open to new experiences and cultures. Until we meet again, safe travels, and may your adventures continue to be filled with joy and wonder. Goodbye.